a food. Oh. I this, this, this. All right, everyone, welcome back to Sasaki Tomiyano, episode three. I think it's three. So yeah, we're gonna see where this jealousy goes. Um, and we're gonna see if the jealousy leads to an actual, you know, like confession, confession, not just like, you know, him just like flippantly saying things. But if you haven't already, like and subscribe, comment down below, turn on notifications, follow me on the socials. If you wanna watch fully unedited or fully uncensored, make sure you subscribe to the Patreon, but support in all formats is appreciated. Also, just to let you all know, Kaguya-sama will be beginning soon on the channel, in addition to Fruits Basket, but it'll be a weekly thing for YouTube, and then for Patreon, it's just gonna be, as soon as I finish the video, then they're gonna get it. So they're gonna be way ahead of y'all, or YouTube. I guess it depends. I don't know why I said y'all. Let's begin. Oh. He didn't search out Miano. Miano came to him. Oh, he got a summons. Oh, there's a delay. Oh. Oh, he wants to spend time with you. Oh. Is it too bitter? It's not sweet enough. Oh, oh, cat tongue. As the cat walks across the screen. Okay, please don't, please, okay. If this were another BL, this this whole conversation would lead into something else. I'm just being honest. I'm just, I'm just being honest, okay? Oh, there, I, I keep forgetting he's a Fudanchi. So like, yeah, like, so he, he thinks the same things. <laughs> Want to find out <gasps> with a kiss? Oh my god! Ooh. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh no! But you are in. Okay, it's so funny how he's a Fudanchi and he is in. He's literally living a BL. He's not picking up on all the signs. See, this is cute, and also this is very similar. Yeah, I've bought at least thirty. This is very similar to um, My Dress Up Darling, where like Maureen like appreciated Gojo for actually like making an effort to like know her interests. He's doing the same with Miano. I'm not looking for a BL expert, yeah. So that's gonna fuck him up. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's not deterring him. Oh, okay. Ex yes. So you are. A food. Oh, I. This, this is what I thought was gonna happen. This is what I thought was gonna. Okay, if it were another B. So now you recognize. <laughs> you want to go out? He's catching on. I mean, he was catching on last episode. <laughs> the way that he just immediately said no. Okay, good. Work through your feelings because you better not turn him down once and then like go run after him later. Yes, and he's making that. He literally has been telling you to your face. What do what do you mean? What did he mean? He literally is. Okay. Okay. Wait, is someone else gonna hit on him? Oh no! <gasps> no! Oh no! He's gonna feel responsible. <gasps> yes! Oh yes! Okay, yeah. Yeah. Literally, he's like being a good person without you being in sight. Ooh, how come you got strong? Oh, we'll see. Okay. Okay, so he has his reasons. But this is, okay. So now he's feeling it. He's crushing too. You didn't give it to him. That you couldn't do anything about it. Okay. Everyone else knows that y'all are going out. <laughs> Oh, no, no, you're misconstruing it. You literally are crushing. Okay, this is where the misunderstanding is gonna come from. It's not just that you think that he's cool though. Wait, what? Oh, oh, you still thinking about that? Oh, because he's probably too shy. Well, he's too confident within his own person to make, to even like care about stuff like that. Period. He's gonna show up no matter what. He really is not giving up on him, like at all. I love it. I love that he's not just like, I'm gonna cut myself off and avoid him. It's like, no. Oh. Now give him the other one. Too close. Too close. 
Oh, I didn't notice that he had a little mole there. That's cute. Oh. 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 Yeah, you're crushing. This isn't. This is a. That's a crush, baby. But these are these are high schoolers. So like, you know, I'm enjoying the process though. So whatever. See, and he's remembering your schedule now. Oh, he's got me marked. But you're trying to process your feelings. He's such a fucking Bishonen. Jesus Christ. Oh, wait, no, he's an Ikemen. So? Oh, no. Don't tell me you're gonna stop lending them to him. I don't think this is gonna get, like, that messy. I hope it doesn't. What? Yeah, she does. <laughs> I love how there have been, like, no women in the show, but all of the women are Fujoshi. <laughs> like, I love that part. Oh, White Day. <gasps> this is where the... Oh, my God. Yes. White Day. Isn't that where the guy gives the stuff back? Or, like, the other person? Yeah, White Day. I'm not really sure about the rules behind it, but so like Valentine's is the girls gives it to the guy, then the guy gives it to the girls on white day. Is that what it's like? Yeah, after all the things that you got in class. But this is Sasaki's second chance to give him something. For the clap? What? He got something for Sasaki. Wait, you were, you were eating it? Oh wait, he did end up giving him something? Oh, they exchanged it. You better get him something, boy. Oh my god, you're literally reading a fucking BL about it. <laughs> no, he's going to... You got look at that. Go give it to him. You gotta... <gasps> no, grow! Oh, wait, yes. Okay, he is? Hirano, what you, what you doing outside? Oh no, please don't tell me someone's giving him chocolates. Please, please don't tell me someone's giving him chocolates. Okay, this is better. Because he probably would be too afraid for him to go back into the class with the chocolates. Yep, he's giving it to him. Oh, boy. This is a huge development. Do you know what this is going to do in Sasaki's mind? Whoa, he's caught off guard. Okay. Are we gonna get a hug? He's dumbfounded. Well, he's not dumbfounded. He's probably super fucking happy. He's super happy. Also, you need to go be nice to your mom and sister again because you were so rude to them. Oh, nobody else? That's what he wanted, the jealousy. He brought you something too, but he overthought it. <laughs> Hirano, no. Okay, I love it. I love... I think he's, huh? Give him, did you go give him something back? What? Okay, no, this isn't the same, Sasaki. This is, and you know he don't like sweets like that. So he's gonna be a third year. He's gonna be busier. You're gonna be a second year. Y'all gonna have to start doing like the career things. Then you're gonna have to think about if you actually get into a relationship. Oh. Here we go. Y'all might separate if y'all start something. But does that mean that he's going to... Oh my god. If they, if they Please. If we get resolution on this, I'm going to love it. Like, if we get resolution of, like, what's going to happen after he graduates and all that kind of stuff like that, I would love it. Wait, Hirano. Oh. Wait, why did he change his hair? Oh, okay. I thought it was for, like, okay. Wait. <laughs> Black haired Uke? <okay. laughs> oh, the Fudanchi is just never going to go away. It's pretty. Then stop bleaching it. No. Do you let your roommate touch it? Okay, this is going to feed into it. <laughs> He'll do it. <laughs> oh, Lord. Who is this? 
Is that the one that was talking to him about the what's my call it? What? Oh, what? How does he know? That was the guy that was in the classroom that day. Okay, you are a problem. It was that guy, but Sasaki, you need to stand up for him right now. Like, not just like you need to like put him in his place. Oh yeah, Miano. Miano didn't hear this part. But she. She's, she's rotten. No, she wouldn't be dating you. Um, I don't want Miyano to be catching strays. You're merciless. <laughs> go hang out with Sasaki. Sasaki's gonna go. Yes. Yeah, fuck you. Exactly, and you were gonna be like hostile towards them anyways. He's doing it to Hirano already. <laughs> okay, I love it. The exception is the one that you actually have the crush on. Are you sure about that? Because you're definitely the uke, and he's definitely the sim. Okay, well, let me, whatever. Someone's gonna ask them if they're dating in public. Oh! Oh, it might be a little too fast. You have to talk to him about it. It's okay. Oh. Oh no! Oh my God, is he gonna fall asleep, fall asleep on the shoulder? Yup. Damn. He's falling so hard, and Miano's like, Ugh. I hope he catches up. <gasps> what? 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 What he just? I. We better know. He said, "I like you." He just confessed to him about, and you woke up, so you definitely heard. He confessed to him. We, you better tell us what the fuck they said. Don't do this show. I will hate this director. I'm lying, I won't hate them. He wouldn't say the things that he's been saying. Are you about to cry? What did he say? Oh, okay, <laughs> period. All right, so now, Next, oh, I'm so excited for next week. Come on. This show does exactly what I need to do. It gives me, you know, wholesome, cute, BL, slow growth. No one's getting sexually assaulted and then like, like, you know, turning gay because you're like, oh, I actually kind of like this. It's like, okay, boo, but you can like, like that and you can still like, you know, have your other life. And like, you know, you can be bi. You know, to be like completely like, I'm gay forever now. And ah, I love cock. Like, oh, oh wait. Oh wait, this is the end of the video. I didn't say anybody, whatever. They're not gonna catch that. But yeah, it's just, you know, slow growth, wholesome, you know, li listening to your feelings, um, uh, sitting with your feelings. I think that's what this show is um, highlighting a lot. Like, these, they are sitting with their feelings and also, oh, I will acknowledge, even though like a lot of these like BL shit like that, like it is high school, but you know, the frontal lobe is not fully developed yet. So sometimes they just do not know how to deal with the feelings that are coming to them, especially when it comes to horniness and liking of people, because those are literally just like procreate, procreate, procreate. And then uh, in the end, you know, like no procreation really happens. It's literally just like, get a nut, get a nut, get a nut, get a nut. So. There, I I appreciate that this isn't one of those BO series where it's literally just like, oh my god, every time we run into each other, we're fucking. It's like, no, it's like, they are working through their feelings. Um, and also, Sasaki literally is doing what, I mean, like, anyone, I feel like, in his situation would do. But also, it depends on, like, the person's, like, personality. And I think that this fits his personality very well, where, like, he's super confident in who he is. He knows what he likes. He knows what he wants. And he's going for it, but also in a way where he is acknowledging like Miyano's place. So like when he like pulled his hand away, he was like, you haven't even talked to him about being in a serious relationship. So like showing like public displays of like physical, like, you know, affection. If you like just skip to that, that's gonna make Miyano basically be like, push you away which he did have that like little jerk in the classroom also where miyano was still going through his own thing so like next week next week it's going to be like pure i feel like it's gonna be more miyano and it's gonna be like you know it's not just that you think he's cool you're gonna have to come to the realization that you like him also also y'all be spending so much time together like come on like i had a friend 
in high school that I spent a lot of time with, but literally there, there was no like romanticism. Like me and him, we played Super Smash Bros. together. We played, um, uh, what the fuck else? We played Super Smash Bros. Disgaea, um, uh, not Disgaea. What, the, there was a like PS1 game. Anyway, we played like Tekken, all kinds of, like all we did was like nerd out together. That was it. This is not this. This is, this is not it. This is not, they're not just like nerding out only. Like there's a lot of, especially with the white day game. Okay. Let me not go into this constantly because I can just like mouth off about this and definitely so if you haven't already like and subscribe comment down below turn notifications and follow me on social media also if you haven't already and you want to watch future episodes fully unedited or uncensored make sure you subscribe to the patreon but support in all formats is appreciated and yeah keep an eye out for those Kaguya-sama re reactions oh my god words thank you for watching bye